Shut down and unplug the power cord. Remove the back panel unscrew 13 screws. Remove the magnetic outer cover. Pull out the Teflon tube and remove the clip securing the Teflon tube. Remove the drag chain cover. Remove the Hotend protection cover. Unplug the Hotend adapter cable. Use a tool to pry open the cable chain cover. Pull out the Hotend adapter cable to reserve operating space. Unscrew the three screws. Disassemble the cable chain. Disassemble the cover plate on the right side inside the machine. Unplug the Hotend adapter cable. Cut the cable tie and pull out the Hotend adapter cable. Unscrew the nine screws on the upper back plate. Take out the old Hotend adapter cable. Install the new Hotend adapter cable. Push aside the upper back plate, pass one end of the Hotend adapter cable through the wiring hole, and place the other end along the upper back plate extending to the host computer adapter board side. Place the cable tie. Insert the wiring. Organize the wiring harness and secure it with a cable tie. Reinstall the cover plate. Tighten the nine screws on the upper back plate. Install the back panel, tighten 13 screws.
Reinstall the cable chain, align the screw holes, and tighten the three screws. Place the hot hand adapter cable into the cable chain and close the cable chain cover. Insert the wiring. Install the cable chain cover, tighten the three screws. Install the Hoten board protective cover. Install the Teflon tube. Install the magnetic outer cover. Self check. Turn on the machine. Click Prepare. Calibration. Auto Leveling. Cutter Calibration. Input Shaping. Start Detecting. Waiting for the device self-test to complete. Enter the Wiki official website to find more information.